What is going on everybody? My name is Brian, but you guys can call me Mr. Creations and thank you for stopping by and watching the video. I do appreciate it very much guys. The gameplay you're watching in the background is some Modern Warfare 3. Yes, I was playing with some old friends. I don't even play with these guys anymore now that I think about it, but this gameplay was recorded back in last August, something like that. And uh, Modern Warfare 3, Moab, pretty quick one, like 3 minutes, 30 seconds, something like that. Good for my standards at least, and yes, Oh my god, Brian, you picked up a ballistic vest, you faggot. Oh my god, I hate you. Yeah, I picked up a ballistic vest, guys, not gonna lie. The game before this, I remember it specifically. The entire enemy team was rocking, you know, secondary launchers and grenade launchers and all that gay shit. So I decided to put on ballistic vest or my teammates were running it for me. And I got a pretty beastly gameplay in the background, so hopefully you guys do enjoy it. But anyways... This is going to be kind of a good old fashioned random commentary talking about a few things. One thing is uh, Gotham City Imposters, that game's free all month long on gold. No, I'm not advertising it. The reason I'm talking about it is I'd never played it before tonight, but I, you know, spent the time, downloaded it because, I mean, it's free. Everybody likes free shit. So I downloaded it and I was like, oh my god, man. Like, oh my god, bro. <laughs> no, but seriously, this game has one of the biggest fun factors I've ever played in a video game in my life. I'm not even joking with you guys. I haven't gotten mad once at this game, which is kind of a shocker, because I get mad at pretty much every video game. I'm kind of a rager. And I haven't gotten mad at this game. I'm having so much fun playing it. There's so much of a silly slash fun factor in this game. It's ridiculous and not even close to realistic, but it's so much fun that I'm just enjoying the shit out of it. I'm going to be playing this game for weeks on end straight. I haven't even touched Call of Duty in weeks, almost a month now, just because you guys know I I loved Call of Duty, and my first Call of Duty was Black Ops 1, and during the lifespan of Black Ops 1, I went back and played Modern Warfare 2, World at War, COD 4. I love all those Call of Duties, but once Modern Warfare 3 came out, I feel like COD started going downhill, so that's kind of where the fun ended for me with Call of Duty. So ever since Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 2, Ghost, all those games just really kind of frustrate me, piss me off, I don't think they have a great fun factor, and that's why I hardly ever play COD anymore, and, uh, I mean, every once in a while, you know, once every other week or so, I'll hop on, play for an hour rage, and get off, get a couple of gameplays for you guys, but Call of Duty just isn't fun for me anymore, that's why, hopefully, and believe me, guys, I'm not getting my hopes up, because I've learned my lesson with Modern Warfare 3, I was getting my hopes up for this game like crazy, and I was definitely severely disappointed, but I am hoping that Advanced Warfare can bring the Call of Duty fun factor back. That's all I'm looking for. I'm looking for a game that I can continuously play every day or every other day and then have a huge fun factor in it. I know there's going to be campers. I know there's going to be bullshit equipment in the game and, and perks that are overpowered. I realize that. But something I really want to see in Advanced Warfare, or at least a couple things is, first thing is dedicated servers. Real dedicated servers, man, as I pick up that sexy mob there. Mob, Moab, whatever, whatever the hell it's called. Uh, anyway, so, I want dedicated servers, real, not half-assed dedicated servers, but real dedicated servers on Call of Duty Ghosts. The graphics look great in the game, now believe me, I'm not a guy that thinks that graphics makes the game everything and amazing, but it is nice, I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty much like Battlefield, so graphics are good in that game. It's sounding like the exoskeleton suit is gonna be in the multiplayer, which, I mean, a lot of people are like, oh, Call of Duty's being copycats, you know, they're, they're copying off of Titanfall with that, you can, you know, do parkour like Titanfall. Alright. Talk about hip hypocrites. I see in the comment section of a lot of YouTube videos, not my videos, but in a lot of other YouTubers' videos, people are like, Call of Duty's the same thing every year. It's so boring. It's so bad. And then those same people, when they see Advanced Warfare and they see it's something different, having the parkour ability and all these things, they're like, oh, they're ripping off a of Titanfall. Ugh, gay. Okay. Are you kidding me? Like, I, I can't stand those kinds of people, to be honest, that, you know, say COD's boring every year, and then they're finally trying to change it, and they're like, oh, well, don't do that. I don't know, those people will always just confuse the hell out of me, but I'm looking forward to this game. I think it has the possibility to have that fun factor again that Black Ops 1 and all the CODs before it had. That's what I'm looking for, guys. I know there's going to be bullshit in Call of Duty every year, but if there is an amazing fun factor like COD 4 had, 
I, I could continuously sit there and play it all day long. So that's what I'm looking forward in Advanced Warfare. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys are looking forward to in Advanced Warfare or any other games of 2014. Hopefully you guys ended up enjoying my video for the day. I keep mumbling. I can't talk. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace.